Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Cliff with Pen Flamingo Power Wash. Got another video for you guys. See, I'm out working in Tampa, Florida for a uh, customer that called me for a driveway cleaning. And I'm gonna be doing some back pavers uh, with a fire pit. Uh, this customer here found me on Google. Um, my location from here is about 12 minutes, 12, 15 minutes. So, you know, I'm gonna get him, get him all squared out. So, um, we're gonna be doing this nasty driveway here full of algae. Looks like it hasn't been, been cleaned in a while. And it's crazy, there's a pressure washing company right over there, right there, doing the house down there. Might go introduce myself to him, you know? You never know when you're gonna need somebody for backup or, you know? It's good to know people in your, in your area. We're not enemies, man. I don't see no competition, but, um. We're gonna be doing this dirty driveway here. We are gonna post um, pre-treat this. Um, I'm gonna probably put down the five percent. We're gonna be doing this walkway here. This house here is like on this little swamp over here. Uh, so this uh, patio here was underwater for some weeks. So it looks pretty bad. Pretty bad, pretty bad. So we're gonna pre-treat this with a 5%. Same mix as the driveway. We're gonna knock all this out for them. Shouldn't take us that long. Gonna uh, pre-treat this, let this sit, go up front, and uh, pre-treat the driveway before we start working. We're all done over here with this little patio. Everything is clean as you can tell. Fire pit is all cleaned up. Everything came out great. I mean, <laughs> we're in Florida, so anytime it rains, good rain, that water rises right there. <laughs> and all of it comes over here. He actually wanted me to come clean these too, but they're underwater, so maybe next time. All right, we all done back here. Let's go ahead and jump out to the front. All right, we are done here with this project. 
driveway is nice and clean. You don't even have to um, post treat it. No stripes. You know what I'm saying? You know how we do. Yes, sir. The drainage leads down this way, goes down here and goes down there. So I got this the best I could. I'm gonna take my after picture and uh, start heading to the second job. We all set up right here with the second job for the day. Right now we're in Cheval, Florida. Uh, we're here for a driveway cleaning. This is an upscale area. Um, actually, I'm supposed to be. <laughs> this shit got a house wash, man. This, but I'm doing this driveway here behind me. It's very dirty. You can tell the sidewalks are dirty also. But house wash definitely needed. Look at all these cobwebs up here. I'm going to show you guys the uh, back. This is the back area right here. We're gonna be doing this uh, lanai. Get that cleaned up. Got overgrown weeds in the cracks. I'm gonna have to, I'm probably gonna surface clean this, pre-treat it, surface clean it, and then um, hit that with my turbo nozzle. Screens are filthy. A lot of, <laughs> A lot of weeds in those cracks. We're gonna, we're gonna hit this right here with a with a five percent 50-50 mix of uh, SH water. Um, probably not gonna crank up my soap or my surfactant that much on this one here. Should be a nice and easy job. Applying my mix right now, using the 5% on it. You know, a lot of guys ask me, you know, is that, would that mess up the screens? It's not gonna mess up the screen if you don't, if you rinse it correctly. If you don't rinse it, you know, you can't expect it not to mess up. You got to. Pink Flamingo Power Wash. All right, how can I help you, sir? You need a, you need services done. Oh no, thank you. I already have one. Thank you. All right, no problem. Treated the treated the pool screen. As you can tell, it looks much better already. Algae's um coming off, so I'm gonna go ahead and start rinsing on the outside and water down everything again and work my way back inside.
cage is done. Nice and clean, man. Look at that. I'm gonna move on and start doing the surface cleaning. Everything's nice and rinsed up. Come out here and show you guys. Yes, sir. is clean right now but I do have some uh, tanning stains because of the tree right above us so as I've shown you before anytime you get these type of stains right here that's not gonna come up with just pressure so those you just push treat them and they'll come right up got some over here need to panic all you got to do even the uh, sidewalk has some and you might even see some lines because the concrete was really 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 dirty no big deal just a uh, post treat uh, you can use a four or three or five percent whatever you want to use all right we're just applying our post treatment right now Nice layer down. You don't have to rinse it either, man. Just apply it and uh, move on. Probably before I even get to the back, I'm gonna show you guys the results. They might even come up if I even go to the back. Y'all chime in, man. Let me know um how much y'all paying for SH in y'all area, man. Let me know where y'all from, man. Down here in Tampa, I pay a uh, a dollar a gallon for SH. So it's really, really cheap. I heard some people paying like. Three, four dollars a gallon. Well, that's a little steep, boy. Gotta be grateful for where I'm at. All 
All right, <laughs> look, I just got done spraying the sidewalk. Look, I ain't even, look at this. And over here where these was, this is all, I'm not even get to edit this, man. Look, all that is gone. The sidewalk on be a little while. But this side I sprayed, look, all this all the stains are gone. Alright guys, project is done. Got the weeds up. Cage is cleaned up. Everything's looking good. Let me show you guys the uh, driveway. So you can see what that, that post treatment is looking like up there. It's already dried. I showed you guys, it reacts so fast. Usually by the time you um, put it down, then um, pack up your equipment, usually the, all, the, all the stains are gone, all the stripes are gone. So this is the driveway. Nice clean concrete. No lines. Sidewalks. All right, we're gonna pack it up and head to the next job. All right, we all set up right here for the third job of the day. Right now we're in Carrollwood, Florida. Not too far from the last job. So it was only like a 10, 15 minute drive. Uh, pretty much gonna be doing the same service I did at the last job, but on this one here I'm gonna be doing a house wash. The house has been painted not too long ago. Not enough for it to get a house wash, but the customer wants to get it touched up. So we're gonna do what she asks. So um, this is the driveway here. Another, <laughs> another dirty driveway. Sidewalks. I uh, got a little porch area. Got a little. Oh, Steelers. Oh, man. Y'all know, man. It's all about them Ravens. Mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna add, I, I didn't see that right there. We're going to be doing this patio here. She wanted this little pad done right there. The paint is, is on chipping on that, so probably just soft wash it. Do this little retaining wall, got some algae that's building up on the top of it, so it's falling down on the wall, dripping down. I'm gonna get that cleaned up. I'll show you guys the rest of the project. I'm gonna be doing these little pads outside the doors. It's raining right now, light drizzle. I don't mind it at all, that to help me to rinse. But we're gonna be doing the screen here and this deck, very moldy, algae everywhere. That probably hasn't been done in a while. But she did ask about her plants, so therefore, you know, I'm gonna take me a good before shot of the plants. I am gonna rinse them down, even though it's raining a little bit. I mean, if it's raining real hard, I probably won't have to rinse as much, but, oh yeah, it's coming down now. You guys can tell. But yeah, we're gonna rinse this up, man. Hit this pool, de um, pool sh this one right here isn't as bad as the last one. I'm gonna use a 3% mix on my proportioner. Pre-treat uh, the deck with the same mix and the driveway with the same mix. But we're gonna do the pool, um, pool screen first. Then we're gonna move on to the house wash. And then we're gonna do the driveway. I sprayed these with my mix already, just to test it out. And uh, you can tell already that it's reacting to the uh, algae. The siding itself is not that bad, but we're gonna hit the house with a 1%. We're gonna wash the house with a 1%. Everything else is gonna be a 3%. All right, let's get it.
right, so we got the cage treated. Um, used to 3% on it, as I told you guys. I felt that that was gonna be strong enough. And you can tell how everything's looking. Nice and clean already. Didn't even have to hit it with the hot lava. <laughs> um, I went ahead and used the same mix for the uh, pavers. I'm gonna go ahead and start rinsing from outside and moving my way inside. When you're working um, close to the pool like this, the deck is so close to the pool, you might get some water dirty water in the pool so try to rinse sideways instead of straight on so you don't push especially when you get to the bottom part you don't push that water inside the pool Man, buddy ain't moving, man. <laughs> hey, look, he's not moving. He just, dude, just chilling out there, man. Look at him. Hey, man, go away somewhere, man. What you doing? <laughs> I ain't gonna mess with him, man. Leave him alone. Alright, that we're done back here. The deck is cleaned up. No streaks, no stripes. Pool is still clean. It's, it's impossible to keep all the water at the pool. Obviously, I kept it clean as possible. I'm not <laughs> no magician. Can't keep all the water at the pool. I mean, we gotta rinse overhead. All these beams that's overhead, they gotta drip in the pool, so. But when you clean the deck, you try to keep as much as you can out of the pool. But yes, sir. I like the I like the results. And I got this driveway. I'll be done for the day. All right, we are done with this job. I had the uh, post street because it had some stains and some lines, but 
It is what it is. Cleaned up under here. Came out pretty good, man. It started raining a little bit, right? When I was packing up in Florida, when I'm saying it can't rain in five minutes and stop. <laughs> but uh, house wash is complete. Clean the pads right here and porch tree those. But yeah, man, pool cage came out fantastic. That rain helped me rinse, rinse a little bit. <laughs> yes, sir. All right, guys, I appreciate y'all checking the video out. I got some good content coming for y'all on Halloween. Special edition. Got something special for y'all. Until next time, I'll catch y'all. Peace.